As a, it is all smiles and handshakes, but it's about to be a bloodbath on the board one way or the other. Best of seven is the format here, alternating all the way. Ryan, who do you got here? I'm gonna put I'm gonna I'm gonna put money on Jim. Jim's played. I've been watching Jim all weekend. I've been watching all the streams, but you know, talking, you know, commentating uh, in and out. And Jim, Jim's played well, but it's Soldier. <laughs> that's and exactly what Soldier right. just do? That that's exactly right. Big run. As you can see Jim is just making a joke it's of like, it. What the heck? I thought that was a friendly game. They're, they're having some fun with this one. I'm kind of surprised, uh, especially for the prize pool level, but uh, it le seems to be leading to them playing even better. And Jim manages to go on the turn with a 100. Uh, let's see another 80 out of one. Oh, uh, Soldier. Nope, we're not going to have it. Not going to have it indeed, but what we're going to have right now is a great final. I, you took Jim Long there, and I, he's in great form, don't get me wrong. But I think Leonard Gates is due for one of these events out here, and he's been having some good runs in the brackets, just get kind of getting stuck in that top 16, top 8 portion. And I, I'm going to be honest, it, it, I think that this one is going to be his event here. And Jim's going to need to bring out all the stops if he wants to slow down the soldier. Well, you know, it's crazy because I know these guys have played each other several times. And I would really like to know their win-loss record. Has Jim always had the advantage? Has Soldier always had the advantage? Is it always neck and neck and one edges the other one? It, it, who knows? Yeah, certainly a great point there. Is a, I mean, both these guys are just great talents representing their areas of the darting world. Right now, Jim Long with pretty good advantage as uh, Gates packs in and it looks like a 140 there. Shanghai opportunity here. Ooh, grab the one. It's going to have to set it up for the next round and hope hope uh, Soldier doesn't take the 103. Yeah, what's your route you don't here? Don't want you, Yeah, that one thing really frustrates you. You got 120 left. Your opponent's on 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 a on an out, and that, that one slips in. It's just unlucky. Yeah, it looks like he fell into that 20 on the first, going down for that 17 to leave double 16. Uh, doesn't secure it. So Jim Long shot at 80. I like the traditional route of trip 12, trip 20, double 10. Tops to win it. Ooh. Second dart a little high. Third dart could have kicked off of it. 46 for the soldier. Double 16. Oh, catches that wire. Double eight. And drags Ooh, it in a little inside. bit. Yeah, very frustrating for him there. So now Jim along with another opportunity to take this first leg underway. Wesley Riley in chat saying, thanks for the great stream as per usual. Ryan, I will see you next week at four singles. Keep up the good work, boys. Awesome possum. Big double 10 right there in the corner for Jim Long. The gentleman scores the first leg. Yeah, he was able to plant it cleanly in there. Not a bad start, 100 for sold. Yeah, I mean, you're going to see these pretty consistent scores from these guys. Uh, I, I feel like they're in pretty good spirits and pretty good focus, and especially if this happens to go the distance, you're going to notice some crazy stuff either because these guys don't really feel nerves in the sense of pressure. If anything, the only thing that they feel the need to is to perform because they want to play their best. I wonder how much stage time these two have combined. How many hours and how many matches have those two in different avenues been on stage in front of Thousands of people blend arts. Well, statistically speaking, they have more than me. Yeah, <laughs> more than me because uh, I have never been on stage like that. Yeah, me neither. Me neither. But these guys, are they're no strangers to, to success in the dart world. I mean, let's be honest. They are some of the best representatives for both these countries, Canada and uh, America, and North America in general. You know, so I'm you know, calling the matches from the United States, but when you – see gentleman Jim Long playing the world championships or uh, in a WDF event or in anything CDC related, you know, you just got to, you wake up and you're like, Hey, this guy's from Canada and he's playing in this series, Moda series. I want to watch him play. Let's go. <laughs> exactly. Let's see. This is an interesting territory of the match right here is they're both kind of nearing that setup range, but not quite getting there. 
45, just, just outside of that. Soldiers right here can uh, break right back. Yeah, he's gonna Not happy two. with that third dart. In a first to four leg format, you don't want to go down to zero early on. You just can't afford to. It's too hard with how well these players are to get that hot of a streak to come back. Unfortunately, Jim's had a little bit in that one uh, the last several turns. He's got to straighten that up. A little bit of haywire dart Leaves there. Leaves himself 96. 96. Trip 20 for double 18. Gets a shot for it. One dart. Check. There it is. Great shot there from Leonard Gates to break back here. Jim Long to go first in leg number three. As these guys are 82.83 for Gates and a 73.41 for Jim. And I know Jim's not going to be happy with that number, but I expect it to go up here. Stats doesn't matter when you're playing this. Playing this, I don't care if these guys threw 50 each. It's first place. It's a, a substantial amount of prize money, and you want to hit the winning double. Exactly. I was told the adage of don't play the stat sheet, play the uh, board. That's exactly what you're going against here. It looks like there was a we little have a score, score correction. Issue. Yeah. Hold. We're going to take a quick moment here to make sure everything's correct. Uh, which is always good. Always make sure with your chalkers that everything's scored right. But it looks like we're about to be good to go. There we go. All right, back to it here. And hopefully that wasn't an ice the kicker moment for Jim Long. No, he, he'll get right back in the match. Leonard able to stack it on that last dart there. Down in the 19s. Yeah, I, I think he's just having a lot of trouble going left and right on the top there. So he's decided to do a comfort switch. <coughs> kind of doing that classic Paula Murphy in that sense. Um, and that well, I mean, pay off. I personally like to use the 19s uh, to, reach, to straighten my 20. My 20's yeah. not going right, and I use the 19's to straighten my 20. That makes sense. Well, my 20's aren't going right. I remember that I'm not good at darts. No, oh, whatever. <laughs> I've seen you play. <laughs> yeah, it's true. On the commentator power rankings, uh, I did pass up Will on that, according to uh, Ryan George. <laughs> Will over here nodding in agreement. That's definitely what's happening. Nothing else. Look at this. Leonard Gates out in front here. And while Long does secure an out, 1-2-6 is a great combination finish. Goes to the 19th to start. Triple 19 for the bull. Doesn't hit it. Right to the 20s. Yeah, that was a great placement on the first there. You almost kind of were led to believe that he was going to stack right on top of it there. 160. Needs another oh, come one on, of those. Jimmy. Give us another one. Give us another one. Oh, my goodness. Give us the tops. We got two in. Come on, we need tops. Oh no! We Little had high. a highlight reel. Oh man, that was a great attempt though. Because imagine that shot there and this timing, the hold throw. Gates to try to break double four. Oh, he pulled that third one. Yeah, it doesn't doesn't find it there. So opportunity back to Jim Long. Going over to that double ten. And finds it there. Well, Lon was behind in the leg. He's able to hold throw. Gates will start it off. Well, two to one. Yeah, I mean, both these guys, they're never going to look at a leg and say, I'm not, I'm not in it anymore. I'm giving up. I'm thinking about the next leg. No, they're going to just think about the game that they're playing and the board set that they have when they walk up, and that's it. And so you can never count any of these guys out. You just matters about who's uh, throwing the last dart in the game. Jim's starting to line up that trip 20. Yeah. Oh, Once it stops going to the haywire for him, it'll connect like fire for him. <laughs> Leonard Gates on the other hand. Playing a little bit more consistent at the moment, but not anything too explosive. And 
can see that nice elongated follow through from Jim Long there. He does a nice uh, little 45 degree angle, keeps that arm, or 90 degree angle, excuse me, keeps that arm nice and straight. Pretty simple classic textbook uh, dart stroke there for him. Nice 1040. Gates right back on the triple. And, and that's an answer. <laughs> Absolutely, it is. We'll see, because Leonard's keen to hold here. Oh, no, and that's some trouble for Jim. I sure hope he doesn't get frustrated because he's had the triple 20, he's had the trip ones, then he's had the trip fives, and he got the trip 20. So you don't want to get frustrated because you're flying a little left, a little right. Just keep trying to straighten that 20 up and keep scoring. Exactly. I mean, at this point, Jim's still up in the match, and even if Gates takes his leg, it'll be even uh, Steven here. So he just needs to make sure to know that it'll get there uh, because once it starts connecting, I mean, it, it's it's something to be seen. We've seen it earlier. Jim Long was playing amazing. A well, little frustration there. Doesn't connect. 115 could go. 96. Oh, my. Level 18. Oh, oh my. my. There it is. 115. Check out for Jim Long. Crazy break of throw there to go up 3-1 in this match out of a game that he who was certain, almost certain, to not have. That's a crazy ability. He just has to hold throw now. That was a huge break. Huge break. Now you throw. 97 to start. Pressure now hitting on Gates right square in the chin. But he's a player that can come through it. You know, th this is truly a momentum shift here, right? I mean, what we're seeing is uh, Gates that has been steady is now going up against a long that has been catching form. And look at this. He, There's I mean, another 1040. I, we, we, we've we been saying it. It was about to connect. It was right there, and now he's just finding it. Gates needs to perform, and look at this answer, though. Oh, it was quick nice cover there. on the 20. 91. 91 on the turn. Gage trying to leave himself at 181. I think the last heart was just a little high there. 140, though. To try to keep him in the running, but Jim in control of this leg so far. Another trip, 19. Fat to 19. Leave yourself tops. There it is. Jim will return for 40. Gates has got to put the pressure on. Yeah, that, that was a uh, textbook setup there. Jim Long showing the experience as this is for the match here for $1,500. Oh, no. We just pulled it. One, two, one is doable, but it's going to take two darts to set it. He's still got a chance here. He does have a chance. Got to be the bull. And oh, he capitalizes man. on the opportunity. That's what you have to do in a situation like that. Amazing shot there from Leonard Gates, punishing the missed double attempt there from Jim Long. Three match of darts, and they weren't connecting, and now we still got a live one here. Jim takes out the 115. Gates falls in 121. But Long's not going to be uh, uh, rolling over after that. In fact, uh, he is going to continue to perform as he's really starting to get comfortable. Oh, unlucky with the third dart. Kicked off it for 55. Trying to thread it between the goalposts, but goes a little high. Yeah, he would, was not happy with that third dart. Yeah, this is really what we expected. And the longer this match goes on, just like we said, if there was a crystal ball in front of us, they are just going to continue to improve. 96. 
continues to stay out in front. He's not on throw, but he's he's definitely on the scores. Gates kicked that last third up a little high there. Really won that 140 there. Well, and I can tell you this much. He's, he's pulled that five twice. So throwing a little high, it's, you know, at least you're going to score the 20 points and not grab the five. No, absolutely, absolutely. The case, one four five is not an easy finish. So if Leonard Gates can set up nicely, this could get real interesting. He needs that triple. There it is. He secures at 110. Good leave there. So one four five, Jim Long. That's a great start. 45? Nope, goes the 19 routes. Doesn't connect. I believe it's 32 left. Oh, 24 left I'm, I'm, there for Jim. My Mark. math was a little bit off. Oh, look at this, though. Is he going to set up or go right at it? 18 or 10. Which one is it? Just taking a moment. Oh, got to think about it. You need to be certain of what you do, and then he has to execute. Double 16. And Ooh, connects there. Bam! What a So we had a 115, shot. we had a 115, a 121, and a 110 out. One, two, three. That's some beautiful ton plus finishing from these guys over here as we take a look back at that. Now we're here. Last leg. There's nothing left. Jim Long needs to hold if he wants this title after three missed match darts. On the other hand, Leonard Gates wants to take the match that he felt like he was in control of early on. Will it come down to the cork? Well, it's alternate all the way through, or, so there's no cork in the no. last leg. No, I'm saying, will, will the whole match come down just to the oh, cork? Oh, from the initial, yes. It very mm -hmm. well could be. I mean, it seriously could be. Will Jim Long hold on, or will Gates break? That's testament of leg seven. Well, right now, I mean, Jim Long's looking prime in his position so far. Catching a little bit of a haywire turn, though. Unlucky. Unlucky. Unless you're Leonard Gates, then you might feel very fortunate. He needs to capitalize, though. One, two, one right here. And he does so. Start to slip back into the game a little bit more here. Oh, come on. Give us a big 180. Well, that will certainly do, though. Great timing from Jim Long. Prime position there, 100 left for him. Gates needs to apply as much pressure as possible. Oh, unlucky on that third dart. Pulled it. This is for the match, ladies and gentlemen. $1,500 for first place. 80 left. Tops, tops. He went to stay on it for the double 10 on the last dart there. Only can set up 145 now is the look for Gates. Everyone just eyes glued to this right now, and Ooh. he's not going to be able to take it. That is a little bit of a good distance there from that treble. Oh, and unlucky with a 24 turn. What an opportunity here for Long. Tops for the match. There it is. He gets it there. Jim Long is victorious against Leonard Gates there. And what was a great match that came all the way down to the last leg. $1,500 is going in Jim Long's pocket.